welcome back um, to my channel. I've been promising myself and a couple of other people now, and I've mentioned in a few videos that I want to get the logo done for the wall. Finally, I've got around to doing it. It's turned out alright. Uh, originally, the lettering I sprayed black, as you you see in the video. Uh, they didn't really stand out with the blue, so then I painted them white didn't stand out because of the white so I decided where is it I'd go with this copper kind of color and it's worked out all right you can change the lights the LEDs anyway <laughs> I'll play with that all the time instead of recording uh, this week I've already done the vlog, it's it's kind of a late but early vlog, it should be the end of the week. If I can try and fit one in I might do one anyway, we'll, we'll see. But anyway, um, enjoy the, uh, the Tuesday Make video and I'll see you at the end. Right, so I've got this stuff. Uh, where's the other stuff? Spray adhesive or photo mount. I don't know, that might work. Let's try this one. Right, so the plan is cut these out with a scroll saw um, and then mount some little plastic standoffs so it kind of brings it away from um, what I'm going to mount it onto. And then it also gives me a bit of a space to put the LEDs behind it. I'd like the LEDs behind it, but if I can't, then I can't, can I? So, I'm sure we'll find something to do. Alright, just leave that to dry overnight, and then uh, I'll uh, bash it out tomorrow. Ooh. Right, on a serious note, if your workshop, shed, um, garage, craft room, spare room, whatever, doesn't end up like this after some spectacular make um, there's a problem either you've not done it right or there's just something wrong I think I better clean it up hadn't I To me, I just come under some maker frenzy and end up just using every tool in the in the garage in the workshop. Workshop. Well, if you don't get all your tools out once in a while, um, you don't know what you got. Um. Right, so I have my ingredients: squash. Squash and uh, cranberry juice in case it gets serious. Gloss spray paint. <clears throat> Twinkly lights. <clears throat> Got my templates all glued up, ready to cut up. That's that. And what I thought I'd do is. I made a, a trailer quite some time ago and I used it for transporting scout stuff um, to camp. I've taken the trailer down and taken it apart now, it's been used for something else. So I thought I would incorporate my sign, my logo into this 
I mean, at the end of the day, Scouts is a big part of my life, so why not? Right, so the battery died, so I went ahead and uh, and cut up the rest of the letters off camera. Um, next thing is to learn how to spell and sand off this this black paper, spray paint them, um, and then we'll start drilling. The, uh, the board at the back to start popping these little lights through. I'm thinking something like you can see it all on camera. Yeah, something like that. So there we go. Let's take them out. Stupid camera stopped recording halfway through, so I'm not sure how much of that you you actually saw. But there you go. There's the the backing plate for the uh, for the letters to be screwed onto. Should look all right. Right, so what I'm gonna have to do is kind of place these on. Um, then get the Sharpie out and I've got 60 of these little LEDs to push through the back and, and then it's hot glue onto the back. So, I'm going to put these on, get the sharpie, dot, 60 dots all around these letters, and then hopefully it will, uh, it will turn out nice. What do you reckon? Like that? Maybe? You know what? I like that. That's how it's going to be. With 
I've got sneaky suspicion. Someone's been in here and taken my sharpie. Probably the kids. you can't really see the lettering so I might paint a line random I don't know we'll have a look Thanks for watching and please if you haven't already subscribed subscribe uh, I'm, I'm quite happy actually I'm up to 72 subscribers so it's coming on um, yeah so please subscribe share like hopefully I'll keep it nice and interesting so you can watch it all um, and I'll see you next time <laughs>